A research facility in the United States has hit a milestone in nuclear energy generation. Nuclear fusion released more energy than what was required to facilitate it. But work that's underway in France could be crucial in making it a viable power source. The International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor in France will be the next step to increase the duration of the energy surplus. The project is called ITER, that means the way in Latin. It is being built as a collaboration between 35 countries and is under construction on a 180 hectare site in Sapol le durand southern France. ITER will be used to prove the feasibility of nuclear fusion. In the latest American experiment, the output was only 0.5% of the energy needed to achieve the reaction in the first place. ITER aims to further firm up the concept of fusion and find a way to make it viable. But of course, that is still decades away. Experiments at ITER were supposed to start in 2025. High power operations were expected by 2035. But now, delays are expected due to the pandemic and perhaps other reasons as well. Just last month, cracks in a key component caused a delay and cost overruns. Whenever ITER does uh, conclude its experiments, green energy going out to power grids is probably some way away. The ITER is an experimental reactor, a commercial reactor which has been dubbed DEMO and it's only expected by 2050.